At the core of their work, educational leaders like Superintendent Dr. Jared Cotton serve students. So when you're looking for ways to improve a school district, there's no better group to ask. I'm excited to talk to our middle school students this year. As you know, I talked to the high school students a couple years ago, and it's so important to talk directly to our students. A lot of times in leadership roles, you don't talk directly to the people who are most impacted by your decisions, and our students and our schools are really our most important customers. So we want to make sure that we get their feedback, we talk to them about how things are going, and how we can make their experience better. And particularly talking to our middle school students this year, they did not disappoint. They shared all kinds of feedback with me. I'm hearing a lot of themes as I go from school to school, and a lot of creative, innovative ideas that they're thinking about. I want to make like a school, like a place where people can have fun at the same time, but also get the education that they need so that way they can succeed in life. I wanted students who participated in different activities, students who had different experiences, maybe even students who uh, don't enjoy school particularly. The idea was simple, but the outcome of the Superintendent Student Voices Tour was powerful. It sparked my curiosity in how to improve my community, which is a, a thing that I think all students should be looking to do. Uh, I thought it was a great experience for me, just being able to analyze problems, get to understanding of how it works. They talked about some phenomenal teachers, and that was something that I really wasn't expecting, but they started talking about how individual teachers have had such an impact on their life. Shout out to Ms. Rich, my favorite teacher. Like seven, I'm in seventh grade now, I have her, it's my, my last bill. Another one of those teachers was Ms. Kolkowski. She's funny, but she makes you understand. And for me, being dyslexic, it's, it wasn't always fun for me. She really breaks it down and teaches you and speaks to you like you're a person. We want to make sure we listen to our students. And like I said, it was time well spent, and I look forward to implementing next steps based on what I've learned. It makes us feel as that we have a voice and people actually do care.